We start by creating a new composition. We'll name it Pattern and click OK. Next, we create another composition and divide its resolution by 10. We'll name it Shape Pattern and click OK. Go to the Polygonal tool and create a shape. Use the up and down arrows to increase or decrease the number of sides. Go to a line and center it. Then move it slightly to the center. Go into Shape, click R and create an animation for Rotation. Set keyframes and add Easy Ease F9. Enter the graph editor and adjust it as I did. Now, let's create an animation for scale. Set keyframes and set it to 120 in the middle. Apply Easy Ease F9. Go back to the start. Create a square of similar size. Something like this. Link it with Shape 1. Go to the 12th keyframe, trim the layers, adjust the length, and our shape change is ready. I'll add a null object. Position it at the center of the object. And link Shape 1 to it. Now I can move and scale both objects simultaneously. Go to the main composition and add the shape pattern composition. Add the motion tile effect, drag it and change some parameters. We can check horizontal and enter 180. Go to the composition menu, choose time and then enable time. Open the keyframes and create a new one at one second, then go to the end and delete the last keyframe. Add the expression loop out with ping pong in parentheses. Duplicate the composition, move it slightly down, go to effects and add fill. Our animation currently looks like this. Create a pre-compose. Name it Pattern. Go to Effects, add Glow, drag it, and set the values to 80 and 100. Set the blending mode of the layer to dissolve. To support my channel, don't forget to like and subscribe.